Hi! In this video we will see how to create this anchor using Rhino Emboss. As you can see I have previously created all these curves. And now let's use the Emboss tool to define first the project settings. So let's start with the measures, height and then cap type. I want to use core with the cap distance and delete base activated so resolution in this case seems enough and checking here we can start adding our Rhino emboss operations in this side panel so I'm going to add a new operation operation type by profile and then I select the curve in this case I need to select this curve you know in here I can change the profile so operation settings I define in this case I will use this one and now I can adjust the measures in here so this is the profile the 8 we can double click and define exactly the 8 we want and refresh to check the result okay this one was successful created now an, a new operation by profile and the curves will be these two curves so I'm going to select this profile adjust the profile 8 let's define 4.5 millimeters 8 and refresh to check the results okay so in here we have we want to keep this whole and don't want to add to the previous profile so under the operation settings I can define the style as highest union instead of had and to keep the whole I activate under this icon so I just need to refresh and easily we have the results now one other operation this time operation type extrude and the curve this one so I just need to adjust the extrusion distance and refresh to check the results once again in the operation settings we can define highest union so refresh okay and once again operation type extrude the curves these two curves and in this case the 8.5 and style I will define subtract so I just need to refresh and here are the results okay I can with this icon hide the gumballs remember if press shift I hide all the gumballs and now I have one hidden surface I want to use to define the relief so I'm going to add a new operation operation type I'm going to define based on geometry and in here I'm going to select the object which is the surface so now I just need to refresh to check the results okay as you can see the relief was successful created I can hide the surface you know one other operation operation type extrude the curves I'm going to select this group and 8 I'm going to define almost in the top so just need to refresh and in here I'm going to define style as highest union so one other operation operation type extrude and now the curve will be this one so I just need to define the 8 in this case I will keep 1 millimeter 8 and operation settings I will define highest union and now refresh to check the results okay this is what I was looking for so once again 
add a new operation operation type I'm going to define extrude again and the curve will be these two curves so I just need to define style as highest union and the eight I'm going to define let's use 3.5 refresh to check the results okay this is getting better I can hide the gumballs add a new operation and operation type by profile so I select the curves in this case the letters and I can hide the results to adjust the gumball and in this case instead of in the operation settings instead of add I want to subtract the 8.5 and show the results and refresh okay as you can see the model is ready and now I can check here to add the mesh to the document at this moment Rhino Emboss is calculating the mesh and before add the mesh to the document it will open the decimator so with the decimator we can reduce the mesh resolution here we have the decimator and in here we can check the mesh results and if needed we can reduce let's try 50 percent and as you can see from the original number of faces and number of vertices we reduce 50 percent and now we can check in here if we lose quality in our model it seems good enough so I just check here to add the mesh to the document okay. so we have the mesh let's change the display mode to check the results here we are the anchor is done in the bottom we have the flat bottom as defined and the model is ready this is the idea really really easy I hope you like it thanks for watching